Definitely not invited. What the hell is going on? Just get in here. We need your help. <sighs> on my way. Okay, now, easy. Easy! Sasha, I'm fine. Thanks. I'm fine. Let's just not have any more surprises today. Oh, come on! Are you really trying to steal our caravan? Now, 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 hold on. It's it's not what it looks... Okay, it is, but I am really sorry, okay? Oh, give us one good reason. We shouldn't shoot you and drag your bodies out that... There's one reason. Hey! We're not done here! Fiona, the door! Out of my way. I don't like it when people lie to me, Sasha. You should never, ever lie to me, Sasha. Just drive. Where? Uh, away from here. I think we lost them. So, what do we do with them? Yeah, Fiona. What did you do with them, huh? I mean, other than try to con us out of our money. You weren't even supposed to be there. Well, that didn't stop you, did it? At least the money was real. Right, all right, I get it. You didn't trust each other. As it turned out, we had good reason not to. I'll give Sasha this much. From the start, she knew not to trust them. Well, I just thought she was being paranoid. Enough. What happened next? Yeah, yeah. Tell the nice man what you did to us next. You know, in our time of need. Tell him what you did then. We tried to throw him out. <laughs> we should just shoot them first. Save the bullet. The fall will definitely kill them. <laughs> Stop it with the embellishments. What really happened? No, actually, that's exactly how it went down. Yeah, I was trying to kill him. Oh. Okay. Continue. Ah! Wait! You don't want to do this! He's just stalling. This is a waste of time. We can find the money! What? The case has a tracker! I can follow it! Let him back in, Sasha. Even if you get that case of money back, you won't be able to open it. It has a top-of-the-line biometric lock. It's impossible to open without me and my passcodes. Get the case into my hands and I can open it. Hey, you say so. But getting the case is the hard part. All right, Hyperion. Prove it. Find the money. Yeah, no problem. Uh... Oh, call the vet. Yeah, Vaughn. I know. You want to call more Hyperion after us? Calm down, Sasha. Let's see what they can do. Thank you. And then kill them if they betray us. Breathe. What the hell is going on down there? You were supposed to do the deal, then come right back. People are looking for you now. Fine. Don't say hi. Oh, we're fine. We're fine. Just hit a minor setback in the plan. A minor setback? That's not what it looks like from up here. Vasquez was already pissed enough about the car. 
That was before he got the call from this August guy. You two have been blacklisted up here, and it's only gonna get worse the more Vasquez keeps yelling. <laughs> Unbelievable! Can't you do anything? Not without implicating all three of us. I already had security asking me everything I know. Can't you just get on the network and track the money? You lost the money, too? It's like I said, Reese. My login ID is being monitored up here. Look, I'm doing my best up here to keep any extra heat off you, but you have to find somebody else. There's only so much I can do. I shouldn't be talking to you this long. They'll trace the signal. All right, and hey, be careful up there, Yvette. I will. Please try not to get yourselves killed. How are we supposed to get an ID from another employee? We're not allowed to talk to other employees. So, you've got nothing. Out you go. Hang on, hang on! Can't you, I don't know, install someone else's credentials? I think we're the only two Hyperion guys left on the planet. Ugh, I still have Nakayama's ID drive. Creepy Black Ops projects like that have to be higher security clearance than us. Look, just give up the act, Hyperion. You're just trying to stall us and we're not buying it. What? No, with this, I'm gonna be able to take us straight to the money. <coughs> you can keep wandering around the desert, or you can look at me and learn how it's done. Vaughn got the tracker working. <clears throat> Vaughn? Where'd everybody go? Nice to meet you, Miss Moxie. Not too shabby, in that crazy Pandora kind of way. Well, guess these three have been together for a long time. Who knows what kind of skeletons that old man's keeping in here. Cast iron steel. Impressive. For con artists. tired of looking and learning, so we decided to wander around the desert. And we looked and learned that you drool all over the floor while you're unconscious. I tracked the money while you were... out. Quiet. This place is crawling with bandits. You okay, Reese? You totally whacked your head right after you plugged in. It made this gross sound. Like a thud. But 
wet. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine now. What happened back there? No idea, just blacked out. All your cybernetics still seem to be working, as far as I can tell. So, the case is in there, somewhere. Wow, what is that place? Looks like some kind of abandoned Atlas warehouse. Doesn't look abandoned to me. Looks more like every bandit on this side of the planet has shown up. How about it, Mr. Roboto? Do you see any way to get inside? Reese, if that's Atlas tech, you should be able to scan it. That Vault Hunter. Oh, perfect. As soon as a Vault Hunter finds a case with millions of dollars in it, it's as good as gone. You know how they are. Worse than bandits. Can't we just go in the same way the Vault Hunter did? We're not Vault Hunters, Sasha. Settle down. I got this. Okay. Something wrong? No, it's fine. Ooh, that hatch goes down underneath the building. But it's guarded. Okay, so you found a way in. Now remember to get in and out of there quickly. We've already taken too many risks today. You're not coming along? Somebody needs to stay and protect the getaway car. I'll be waiting for your signal. And feel Sasha. Be prepared. Don't trust anyone. We've got a way in, but how are we going to get down there? Have you forgotten about the bandit parade going by? <laughs> That's the easy part. First, we find a crappy hiding spot. Then, we make ourselves a new friend. Fiona and Sasha find cover in order to sneak closer. While we casually take our new pal for a stroll. Then we borrow a gun from one of the guards, making sure that his buddy doesn't feel left out. Then we take the secret entrance, which leads us to the briefcase. Then we take a moment to celebrate our swift and easy victory. We are good to go. Everyone got that? Guys? Damn it. We found another way down. After you. My way would have worked. I got this, okay? Just give me a second. Fiona! Fiona! Open up, please! It's pitch black in here. Would you chill out? You were hoping this would happen. You wanted to separate us so you could pick us off! Hyperions! <sighs> I can't believe I trusted someone from Hyperion. We should never have let you come with us. Keep moving. 
If you're not running the show. If you got a better idea, then... Fine. What would you like to do? We should keep moving. Walk in front of me. Vaughn, do you copy? Come in, Vaughn. Damn it. Money's on the move, but it's close. We have to hurry. to get to that lift. Yep, easy. I'll take the one on the left, you get the one on the right. Oh, do you think you can handle that? I know you Hyperion guys don't like getting your hands dirty. They probably didn't teach you this kind of stuff in finishing school. Oh, I'm not worried about me. Because I took out a dozen bandits earlier today. Are you sure you can handle it? Um, are you serious? I don't know. You talk a big game, but I haven't seen you in action. You just make sure you don't scuff your nice little shoes, okay, Hyperion boy? <laughs> They're skag skin. They're atrocious. Come on. Joking. Relax. That's not funny. Just a little end around here. Get this to line up with. Oh, come on, really? I thought we were past this. Past this? Do you even know what Hyperion means to us on Pandora? The havoc they caused here? The pain? It doesn't matter what you do up there, you contributed. It's crazy up there, too. Things actually aren't so great at Hyperion right now. Yeah? Feeling the weight of your corporate overlords, Arya? Good. Um, what the hell was that? It's 
one of the power systems starting up. How is it up there, anyway? Where? Up on that base you're all in. What's it called? Helios. Right. Helios. I mean, what's it like being an emotionless cog spinning away, day after day, for the most bloodthirsty, brutal, soul-crushing, love-defying corporation in the whole wide universe? Is it fun? Is it something you like? I'm just curious. Look, it's not that easy, okay? Everyone's more than happy to climb the corporate ladder, even if it means using your face for a rung. Ugh, sounds awful. Eh, it mostly is. I, uh, I have to concentrate. Can I help you? Your stun baton. It's the JR-4000. Can I... Can I see it? Hold it, I guess I should say. What if I say please? Would that make it easier for you? Because I'm not saying please. Even though I've technically said it twice now. Do you promise to give it back? Yes. Pinky promise? Yes. Don't hurt yourself. You, you might work for the worst corporation in the universe. They do make some cool stuff. I feel like that's the case with most corporations. Thanks. Oh, look at us. We're like best friends now. Hmm. Not quite. And we are in. Password override. System online. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. I'm impressed. I suppose you're not completely useless after all. Aw, oh, shucks. You mean it? Yeah, get the lift moving. I got in, but it didn't give me the right clearances, so I'm gonna need a second. Well, hurry up. What the hell? Damn it, not now. Glasses face and Hadley. You guys really know how to accessorize. What are you two doing here? Oh, hey. Um, <laughs> it's a funny story, actually. What are you doing here is more like it. Okay, uh, you're not really supposed to answer a question with a question. I already know what I'm doing here. Really? And what would that be? Wow, okay. That's aggressive. Sort of caught me off.